Hey students, how are you doing? Welcome to Naya Sim. If this is your first time of coming across this channel, so you've had kind of smart that subscribe button and turn your notification so you are notified each time I upload and please give this video a thumb up. I appreciate you all so much and I'm saying a very big shout out to every one of you for the love, the support you all show me here with. I am grateful and you all are super sweet. So today we'll be talking something very important and it's about a palm, not palm color. What am I even saying? A Hispanic woman who actually came out to gaslight black people and black women. She started by saying that uh, she is happy that she is not black because black people do not have her, that they are, they are bald. So actually, so many people responded to her with their natural hair. I mean, their crown. I mean, it's just really amazing when you see black women, when you see their hair flowing in it. I mean, some with oh my goodness i love them they are so beautiful so they all came out in masses to show flaunts their hair and all that but then the person that said that she does not that she's happy that she's not a black woman is wearing braids or locks i think locks right and she was removing it out and have the nerves the gods to gaslight black people why she is wearing something that is meant for them the irony is just it shows the lulu some people are very delusional and looking for solution to their delulu because if not why would somebody why would somebody wear something that is for a particular culture and uh, she is gaslighting like she's throwing shade are the same people trust me the irony is just mad and i am happy that she is not also black because we do not want people like them to be in our community it's as simple as that yeah we do not want them they do not like black people that they want to they always want to get lip filler to look like black people they want to tan their skin and most of them are criticizing black men if care is not taking she's probably looking for a black man to date and then they come back to gaslight themselves. Let's get into Glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. Sorry. I'm glad I'm not black. <laughs> y'all, y'all. Girl, you ain't never lied, girl. Cause we just be wearing these bonnets and stuff. Just joking, girl. This, this is all a game, girl. It don't be nothing up on the hair for real, you know. This, this, this is an illusion. Okay, this this is an illusion, you know what I'm saying? It's crazy because if I spray it or even if I, you know, if I like straighten it, it just be like crazy long. It's like, it's, it's, it's crazy. I don't even know what to call it. Like in the girls, the black girls that you see with like the wigs and stuff, underneath them wigs, they be having crazy amount of hair. Like ain't no way they got me bald in real life. It's like magic. That I think you're just pissed off that you don't have. You want to cry about it? get straight hair don't that mean you want to be white when y'all bleach your skin so just fuck the lip fillers and the self tanners that are as black as that fucking lamp and the booty fillers and the squads just fuck all that shit fuck the thin hair fuck the sensitive ass skin just but we're genetically bald wow Talk about illiterate is a motherfucker. Just saying. Wow, she has the audacity to wear braids. She's the same one that says Vikings had. Go to fucking. Straight hair? Don't that mean you want to be white when y'all bleach y'all skin? I'm going to ignore the fillers, the braids, the black scent. I'm going to ignore all of that because we're done talking about that. We know what they're doing as a caricature of black women. Instead, I want to try and address their question. Doesn't that mean that y'all want to be white? Why do you wear wigs that are with straight hair? Why do you bleach your skin? So my follow-up question to kind of like engage the mind here, um, a guided question, if you will, is why do you think people do that? If you need a bit longer, you can pause. The answer? white supremacy yeah the answer is white supremacy culture because whiteness the social construct of whiteness has been elevated so much that marginalized groups felt like they had to do these things in order to survive when you i'm glad i'm not black 
Y'all have no hair. Come here, you John Mayo. It's giving obsessed. It's giving I don't know shit about black women. Don't hate because y'all can't do the same shit that we do with our hair. Simple. And no, we're not bald. You see this beautiful black girl right here? Yeah, hair full of hair. And I got weave in right now. Don't be mad because you can't do what we do with our hair, boo. Bro, I'm glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. So Who ain't got no hair, though? Who ain't got no hair, sugar mamas? Who? Bro, when y'all get straight hair, don't that mean you want to be white? When y'all bleach y'all... Hey, love. I seen your video. You said black people don't have long hair. Girl, I'm here to tell you that you clearly don't either because you cut your braids this short. So, I mean, that means you have either this length and up. So, clearly you don't have long hair either. Have you seen TikTok? A lot of black women have long hair. So, I don't understand why you figure that we don't have long hair. Why? Because we wear weave. We pay good money for it. So, why can't we wear it? I mean, you sound ignorant. You really do. You sound ignorant. It's giving, I'm trying to be black, but can't pull it off. So you're upset and mad that we can just wear that style comfortably and you can't. I'm sorry that you can't, but you know, it, it is what it is. You're trying to wear a predominantly black style that you know was inappropriate, but yet and still trying to justify it with saying, oh, y'all wear straight hair. It's the same thing. It's not, but okay, if that's what you need to tell yourself to make it better for you, then that's okay. We know what happened to the last person that wore braids of your color. Um, I believe her name is Crystal Crave. Um, she called out one girl of your color that tried to wear the same braids, cornrows. We see how that turned out. Oh, that poor girl hair fell out really bad. But you know, maybe yours won't. Since we're giving tips, I got some tips for you, girl. When you immediately take those braids out, we put perms in our hair. Dark and lovely. Leave it in there for about an hour. And then you know what? This is a conditioner that we use. It says leave it in there for five minutes. When you leave it in there for five minutes, girl, tell me how I look. Tell me how I look. I, I swear to how your, your hair is so nice and soft. You you keep forgetting that we in an era where you can fuck around and find out. Please don't be one of those ones to fuck around and find out. Bro, I'm glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. Hey y'all, so can we make a vow from this point on that whenever they come up and start talking like this, we just do this. Glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. Sorry. And that's what you call right there, hater, okay? How you taking out the black hairstyle talking about we bald? Y'all mad because we can do too much with it, all right? If we are bald, it's by choice. And then we can be bald today and, and, and down our backs tomorrow. Is you mad or no? Where y'all be getting that shit from? Because y'all need to cut it the fuck out, okay? <laughs> you want somebody bald taking out the black hairstyle. Goodbye. I'm glad I'm not black. Y'all can run the video back or whatever, but really, girl, we glad you're not black either. Really, to be honest, y'all want to be have our whole style, mannerisms, demeanor. Y'all want to be just like us, but you sit there with a head full of braids in your hair, talking about we buy our hair. Do you buy that hair you put in your head? Mm -hmm. You very much so did, girl. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We pay for it, though. We ain't broken bald headed, though. Know that. Bro, I'm glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. I know, right? It's crazy how they ain't got no hair. Damn, I wish I could get this braid out. <laughs> when y'all get straight hair, don't that mean you want to be white? When y'all bleach y'all skin? Hey, hey, TikTok. So, um, I keep seeing this video going around, circulating around, trending right now, and everybody's been, re like, every black folk left and right have been reacting to it, like, from showing the long hair, because she also made a comment about how so-called black women don't have hair, 
and you know we have black women in response um showing their hair and i'm just like this is time and time again this is going to keep happening and it's i know it's easier said than done but it's we you have to ignore these people stop giving them ammo stop giving them your time and energy they don't even respond like it's it's really like really they're here to just get their little views and clout and go and it's just like you're basically giving that to them like we we got to stop falling for the the bait cuz that's all it is like this chick already look crazy as hell anyway like I don't care. Like, y'all have no hair. So and see, this is why, this is why I encourage my sisters to wear. Wear your, wear your crowns. Wear your crown. You remember? Like, I know that shit tedious. You feel what I'm saying? You gotta go through your, 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 um, your nightly routine. You feel what I'm saying? Because you know. I hear, I hear a little bit different, you feel me? Some of y'all had that full C, some of y'all got that full D, you hear me? I understand, my love, I understand. But look, man, wear your crown, baby. <laughs> I love you, I love when a black woman wear a natural hair, son. Ooh, that shit do it to me. You can cover your ass over here if you want. <laughs> In your natural hair. <laughs> I'm, trying to, I'm trying to tell you what's going to happen. <laughs> it's going to be crazy, man. Where y'all crowns, black women? That shit is beautiful. Fuck what they talk. Fuck what they talk about, you remember? For real. Where your crown? For real. Glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. Sorry. I mean, it's quite obvious that I need to do something with my hair, but I'm in the house right now. That's why I'm wearing a bonnet and why my hair looks the way that it does. But that's besides the point. Um, you tried it. You, uh, you tried it because, uh, vice versa, I'm glad that I'm not white. Not even trying, like, not even trying to be racist. I'm glad I'm not white. It is absolutely embarrassing to see y'all in real time, in real life, act the way that y'all do. Like, you thought that you ate? Please. <laughs> glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. Sorry. It's so fun how you say you're glad you're not black, but you taking out a black woman's hairstyle. Girl, get the hell on. Bone as well, sweetheart. Bone as well, love. Where do you see the bald scalp at? Us as a community, we still try to figure that out. Bald who? Not us too. <laughs> Play with something safe and put some respect on our motherfucking name. Four years lock. Let's get into it. Oh, my. Say what the young kids say. She ate and left no crumbs. Hey, y'all ain't about to keep getting on Soldier Boy's internet and, and disrespecting people. Hey, especially the black women. Y'all got to chill out. Cause, cause, cause they, they tearing you a new one in them in them, uh, them little video they doing. Yeah, showing off. Yeah, long hair don't care. Look at tonight. You know, people, people minding their business. Y'all just come on here, yeah, with the... Then you want smoke and then they flame you. You know what I'm saying? Propane. It's my favorite little saying, you know, propane. But real quick, can we talk about how natural is just my look? Natural is just like 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 the natural hair, no matter if it's short. You know, you can have a fade, you know what I'm saying? Uh, short, long, you know, the curly, like, or no makeup. You know, makeup is nothing wrong with makeup, but like, no makeup, just top tier. I'm glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. Sorry. The black women had a meeting, and we're all happy that you are not one of us. You are a Dollar Tree imitation of what we are, honey. You're a character of what you see on TV. So keep being the character of a black woman, while black women actually be out here black women -y. because you cannot compete or you don't compare, honey. Black. Y'all have no hair. Bald wear. Bald wear. I'm glad you're not black. Ignorance to come out your mouth makes me really upset to even know that someone put that shit in your head. Please, 
Stop being a little dumbass. Yeah, your shit's going to fall out eventually. You know, you're going to go bald. You're going to do all this, that, and the third. You know, and we're just all going to look at you and laugh. Because of the ignorant shit you posted. Because of the ignorant shit that came out your mouth. Because of the ignorant shit. Nope, the ignorant way you look. I'm pretty, I'm pretty, I'm happy you're not black. Please. Please go fuck yourself. Glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. Sorry. I'm glad I'm not black. That's one thing we can both agree on. <laughs> I'm glad you're not black. <laughs> look at you. Just look at you. You look crusty, dusty, musty, funky, all the key. Ugh. You make me sick. Bet your hair is dirty as fuck. Bet you smell like shit. Look at you. You make me sick. Bro, I'm glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. So Malcolm X said the most hated woman in America is the black woman. He passed away how many years ago? I'm glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. Sorry. And you know what's crazy about that? You think somebody who derives their whole personality from an entire group of people, they would be educated on this topic, right? Apparently not. For those of you that don't know, black hair is like in its base form. So in its natural state, it's gonna be this size. But if it's straightened out or anything, it's gonna be double to triple this length. And you know what's even crazier? A video like this about five years ago would probably just ruin my day. Because I was definitely on YouTube looking up how to get curly hair, three easy steps. I was going to middle school and early high school with my hair all wet and I had a whole bunch of Cantu dripping down my face and shit, bro. Believe it or not, bro, I had a Cantu collection out the ass. This shit was crazy. Let me show you something. See all this dog? I wanted to have loose curly hair so bad. It was a little phase of mine, bro. So point being, embrace what you have and don't listen to intellectually challenged people. It does no good for you. You know what I'm saying? It will ruin your mental health from the inside out. You guys have a good rest of your day. Glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. Sorry. I'm glad I'm not black. <laughs> y'all, y'all. I find this so crazy how a lot of non-black women constantly run with this narrative that black women don't have hair. Because not only is it a lie, because we do have hair. A majority of us have very long, luxurious, nice hair. Now, let me explain to you why this physically doesn't make any sense, right? Black people are the only racial group on earth who can have any hair type of that which is predominant in another race naturally grow from their scalps. Whereas for other racial groups, it is not the other way around. Afro kinky hair is predominant and exclusive only to black African people. But we are being told that we can't have hair on our head, Abby. Does that make sense? Some of us don't understand that when it comes to hair, density matters more than length. I dare any non-black woman to step to a black woman with both their natural hair, stand in the rain for five minutes and let's see who comes back with some hair on their scalp. Because let's keep it 100, some of you not only have hair or full looking beautiful hair simply because it's dry. The minute you wet it, it's transparent. Whereas with us, wet, dry, dry, wet, we have the same volume and depending on how far your hair shrinks, roughly around the same length. This is also the reason why we can do things like braiding and bleaching and all these things and we can still keep our hair whereas the minute some of you lot braid your hair, your scalp is on the floor. So please stop coming out here and talk about black women don't have no hair because as you can see from even one of my pictures, fine babe, we have hair, okay? You lot have a blessed day and good night. Glad I'm not black. Y'all have no hair. So this is all I got from the stitches and uh, to think that uh, some women, I didn't know how, but like, you know, women will come out to drag their fellow woman, women, you know, coming from somebody that looks like uh, a little bit copy of black people. I mean, telling black people, you all are 
wow why she is when she is is she not wearing something that looks like black hair what black people how they make their hair and she has the guts to say she's happy that she is not black number one is that i am sure that black people are very very much happy that she is not part of us i mean we're happy but these are the people that admire black women and go behind the back to do what black women do to look like black women if care is not taken she might actually be looking for a way to date a black man but she's out here cursing on black women i mean we are really very happy that you are not black and to think that they always look for a way to gaslight themselves because they are not gaslighting black people number one is that black people have hair which most times we choose not to probably flaunt our hair because it's uh, hard to maintain. Sometimes we just want to wear protective hairstyle and put our waves on because we do not. Maintaining black hair is hard. But it is only black hair that can do so many things. A black hair will look very short. But when you blow dry or something straighten it it is more than their hair and then they still come out to tell you that you do not have hair that you want to look like white because you straighten your hair it's just crazy it is crazy and uh, i feel some people are really very delusional because if you are not delusional you are not gonna come out here to say black women do not have hair they're all bad they want to look like white people when you all, all you all want to do is hold that white supremacy. Like, you all want to be white so bad. Is that not true? You all want to be so white. And you have the guts because our hair is, uh, I mean, you have the guts to come out to say, you all have that messy hair and the rest of it. Man, we don't want to be you. We do not want to, even in our next world. We still want to come out as black. We still want to have our hair like this. We still want to be the way we are. And let me tell you all something. They forget that white supremacy is the reason why most people try to lighten their skin. Because they want to feel included. They want to feel among. Because they already told us that the standard is palm colored and let me tell you something now i think people should stop all this wanting to lighten your skin and all trust me it's not gonna pay you because in the end it is still the melanin that is going for how many grams that people already started taking injection for that it's going to be the standard so let it go sis wear your natural skin wear it flaunt it maintain it enjoy it wear your natural hair if you can if you cannot it's okay wear a protective hairstyle it is nobody's business if they choose to be in black people's that is their problem not yours do you baby the world is gonna adjust as you can see they are already adjusting shout out to all my black women you and black men too you all are awesome see you all in my next video bye for now